All right, here's what it's going to be. DeSantis versus Gillum in the general election come November. Uh, really, the nation going to be watching the third largest state in the country, Florida, for their governor race. Could be foreshadowing for what's to come in 2020 in a presidential race. Donald Trump, of course, endorsing DeSantis. DeSantis, a big supporter of the president. Andrew Gillum has an ad out right now said he wants to impeach the president. Big differences all over the spectrum and take a look at these voting numbers. 913,000 Floridians voted for Ron DeSantis, the Republican. Compare that to 517,000 who voted for Andrew Gillum. A uh, big difference there. Of course, Andrew Gillum running against four other very popular Democrats. Ron DeSantis really only had Adam Putnam to run against there, so that would skew the numbers. But keep in mind, as we look at statewide registration here, when you're talking Republicans, Democrats, and those who are not associated with a party. All right, closed primary, meaning only Republicans could vote Republicans. So four and a half million. Registered Democrats only voting for registered Democrats, 4.8 million. Now, those guys were all in the primary election, but take a look. There's still three and a half million votes out there, give or take, who these guys will have to go, who are minor party or no affiliation at all, who could not vote in yesterday's primary. And that's going to be the big number to watch come the general election and who DeSantis and Gillum will really be going after.